Hey guys, what's going on? Happy Sunday to you. It's, you know, your, the evening Sunday chit chat with your girl Stacy. Today is a quiet day, as you can see. Football Sunday for me and Cheesy. He is looking at the Carolina Panthers game, and you can see right now, I think he's up by one game. Well, he lost one game, so we'll see how it goes. Um, basically, it's a football Sunday, and guess what I started today, guys? My diet. I got on the scale, and guess how much I weigh? I will be honest with you, family. Uh, we are whopping 142 pounds, so that means I have to lose 20 pounds. No problem. You know, old girl's been in the Army for so long, and I know how to lose the weight. But looking at the game, the score now, ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching Cleveland, New England is 0-10, New England. New York Giants, 26 to 31, Detroit 1. Wow. Oakland, 7. Houston, 0. We're in the first quarter. Just started. And uh, right now, the Carolina Panthers, I have not checked. We're going to check in just a minute. So right now, it's just the uh, Cleveland Browns game against New England. And he know to put it on the Panthers because this is the Panthers' house. And the score is 321. No! We are in the second quarter, 7 minutes, 24 seconds. 26 uh, I'm second down and 10 yards to go. So guess what, guys? It's an early game because, you know, in the end, the Panthers are going to turn it up. Um, we got a new quarterback because, you know, Cam is out with a foot injury. But the young man has doing, been doing great things. He may not be an expert mind just like a uh, San Francisco quarter, uh, quarterback. But guess what? Give him time. I promise you, in the fourth quarter, Carolina Panthers is going to prevail. But getting back to the diet, guys. I just set aside going to uh, get some couple things I need for school today. So cooking a big meal. It's gonna be nacho Sunday. Maybe a nacho salad. Like guys, I love Wendy's. I do. I love Wendy's, but I cannot be eating bad the burgers and all that. So this is what I did. I went and got me a nacho salad, which consists of 329 calories. I'll break it down into two evening servings. So, but first is how I like to do my thing. I like to take the tortilla chips off. I guess you guys can call it the nacho salad challenge, uh, 30 days <laughs> challenge, because every other day I'll be eating one of these. Maybe not so much meat, but basically salads, you know, good food, you know, protein, carbs at the right day, five, six small meals, work out at least hour a day, carbs, I mean, doing a cardio or weight training or some type of activity. With one day off. Okay. But anyway. I feel like something is in my hair. Oh, but anyway, um, basically I'm just taking that. I'm gonna add my chili. I like to put my chili right in the middle. Uh, gotta bear with me, guys. I'm working with one hand here. I have a sprained ankle. I mean, a sprained uh, wrist bone. Excuse me. Uh, so I'll just take the chili, place a little bit in here. Um, yeah. Let me see if. Of course, yeah. You want some? Yeah, get, yeah. You want some salad? You want some chili? I just eat the chili and bean. Okay. So right. Right. You you want you? Huh? I'm just all I need. All right. Well, anyway, I'm sharing. I'm sharing. You know, guys, if you got somebody and you can't eat all the serving, give them some chili. Give them some chili. Give them some chili. Chili and crackers right, are good. Yeah. But anyway, getting back to my live, telling you about my salad. Um, after I do that, um, I put my little. I like to make mine decorated, guys. I like to put my little. Tortilla chips to the side here. Oh wow! Yeah. Going on. Oh, this is gonna be so cute. And also, guys, I understand that this chili is great. Sometimes, you know, if that's not enough chili, you want to make a bigger salad. You know, just use the contents that you get from Wendy's. Go to Dollar General or some grocery store. Get your cheap can of beans. Or me, I like to call it. Get some chili. I like the chili without the beans, but. This is what I'll do. I'll make it cute, you know. Put a little salad here around there. I always got to cook a big old Sunday meal. I like to cook those right around the season of Thanksgiving and uh, Christmas. But today, <laughs> but today is just a light salad, taco salad. And I hope you guys like it. I'm trying to make it as cute as possible. You know, we women like to cook, make it look pretty. So after that, I. May put a little bit of more. But anyway, I need to find my 
Oh God, I know you guys are gonna kill me. And this is the part that where you gotta really think about what you wanna put on here. Today is going to be salsa, signature salsa. I don't like salsa, so I'll give this to him. And then put in that salad, the uh, beans, cause you put it in there and makes it, gives it a hot, spicy taste. So I guess I will put a little bit of salsa. I love salsa. Give me a minute guys, so applying the salsa to the salad. And I'll just take a little salsa. Make it pretty. Yeah, and I'll save him some salsa. Salsa is real good in red beans, rice, but anyway, that's a Cajun dish for another day. And now I am looking for the most thing that makes your taco salad a taco salad. The what, ladies and gentlemen? The light sour cream. Notice it said light sour cream, meaning half the calories. So guys, I'm gonna open this. Just give me a minute. Normally I would have these contents already open. But since we're getting this from Wendy's and I am not making it homemade like I normally would, but a salad is never really homemade. Oh, it's out good. Don't forget. Well, guys, I learned something else on the internet. That sour cream is only excellent turn buttermilk. <laughs> and uh, when this get warmer, guys, I'm going to share a recipe with you called uh, buttermilk and cornbread. Hot water cornbread. Definitely good on a snowy day. But right now, let's move these 25 pounds first. <laughs> and I'm applying two sour creams on this because I love sour cream, but I'm going to share it. And there we have it. We have a beautiful taco salad by Wendy's. And I'm going to find a fork here and let you see it. And then it's gonna be bone appetit for me. Let's see. As you can see, I already added my sour cream, salsa around the edges. And of course, you got underneath the cheese and everything else, the artives, the guacamole, depending on how you like it. And, and that's going to be for me in less than eight minutes. Sunday dinner. Throwing everything away, guys, because I gotta have a clean house. I can't stand a nasty house. And for college tonight, guess what my choice of beverage is gonna be tonight? Not wine, guys, but classic roast coffee. <sighs> but anyway, I'm gonna dig in this salad, guys, and I just wish you guys have a blessed and happy Sunday. And if you wanna get the recipe or get this uh, particular recipe, guess where I got it from? Great Wendy's. Peace.